Hello and welcome to Netherless Place. This is Burning Daylight. Never played this game before. Don't really have any knowledge of what exactly it is. <laughs> but it's free and it's short. So I decided, hey, let's give it a shot. So uh, let's jump right into it. Press W to move, okay. Guess I'll move the mouse over here in the corner, out of the way. See my dude's donk. <laughs> okay, so we can control now. Uh, I'm hoping my guy doesn't walk this slow throughout the entire game. <laughs> because, uh, yeah. All right, so we've got piles of dead bodies everywhere, it seems. We have some thing moving in the background. Um, I'm hoping this isn't the entire game. I'm gonna go to this light thing just to see if it does anything. Oh no, never mind, I can't. Am I supposed to go over there or do I just keep walking? Yeah, I'm supposed to go over here. Okay. At least he's moving faster now. Oh, man. Um, how do I get up? Oh, never mind. I guess I just go this way. There's a bunch of dead bodies everywhere. So I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> Hex. I wonder if they want us to use like a controller for this. Okay, I can go over there. I can go over here. Can I get this? Oh, okay. So let's see if there's anything this way. Nope. Alright, guess that gives us some light. Had to put up. There we go. Do I push it in? Push it back. Where am I taking it though? 
Oh, okay. Get some speed. Should I go check the other door? Just to see what was in there? Let's go do that. Just to see. we missed anything over there because it looks like this is the way we're supposed to be going if the camera would like move so I can see <laughs> alright let's go over here alright that's locked what if I hit this nothing alright So, I don't know why they have that door there. Come on, why can't I? There we go. The controls for this are kind of weird. Like, they're not. Come on. Is this door just not going to open now? Yeah, see, look. There's like an invisible wall. Now there's no pop ups. I think I just broke the game. <laughs> Let's try. Let's try turning that off and then going. Yeah, see, invisible wall. So I have to like move over here just so I can get down here. Not there. We, nope. See, now the door won't open. Let's hit the switch. Yeah, see, I'm pressing the open button, but it won't open now. I broke the game. <laughs> oh, or I can just go right through the door. Okay. <laughs> Go inside the tube. Oh, that's gonna like hurt your butt. Bunch of like Indian burn on your ass. Okay. Can I go over there? No. So the music really picked up. Can I, like, stop this? Nope, I guess I just keep going. Just ignore him. Ignore his plight. Don't bother to help the man. He will provide. Okay, so we got broken glass. We can't crawl, and I'm not even on it right now, but I'm just so, okay, I think I'm just like stun locked. Yep. Yeah, I'm stun locked. Alright, is this exit? <laughs> uh, okay, I was here. Oh, there we go.
Alright, we got shoes now. <laughs> Poor dude. But at least now we can get past the glass. Do we want to go in here? Some pants would be nice. And we have a little... Little twigs and berries and just flapping around. This game kind of reminds me of Odd World. Reminds me a bit of Oddworld and uh, Final Fantasy VII, like just Midgar, like the slums and all that stuff. Okay, can't do anything over there. Oh hey, there's other people that we can't interact with. I guess we can't go back the way we came because we can't hop over that. Okay. We got some... Damn. How's that dude still alive? Well, at least we got a sweater now. I'm pulling a Donald Duck right now. <laughs> Industrial facilities. It'd be nice if we had some pants. Well, that's not good. Lady, I know you're crying because it looks like maybe your husband is dead, but do you think I can borrow his pants? Because he's not going to need them anymore. This dude's like cooking. I'm just going to put my balls right on his food. And again, if he's cooking then, I'm putting my balls on him. I'm going to burn my balls. <laughs> Could be trash, actually. So I'm just putting my dick on a bunch of trash. What's up, dude? Everyone's wearing like goggles. I've noticed. Is there like no pants whatsoever?
Alright, I'm not moving him now. This is a cutscene. Okay. I don't know what I fell down, but... Alright. Do we go up here? Get that switch or something? Yeah. Can we take that person's pants? What's this? The fact that everyone was wearing these and everyone seems to be messed up seems like it would be a bad idea to put them on. Alright, move. Do I have to interact with this? No, there's no button there for me to hit. But I have to, because if I go this way. Nope. Alright, just keep them on going then. Am I supposed to do that and then go somewhere? I'm assuming that up there is an elevator. So we just have to keep... Why? Because we're naked or because... I mean, because we have the goggles on, but how would they know that our goggles are different than theirs? Music is kind of cool. Yeah, see, the goggles seem like it's leading us to a very terrible place. Like, I don't trust it. I don't trust the voice that I'm hearing. Alright, come on. Oh, you have to be, like, perfect on this to get the prompt. Oh, let's see. Alright, this is baby, baby steps. Baby steps, there we go. And it's just funny for some reason. Then again, I'm very mature that way. I don't know if I was supposed to be doing this. Hey, I got some pants. If I'll put them on. Come on, dude, put on put on some pants. You got pants right in front of you. Put them on. Nope. 
I guess he got used to free balling. Yeah, see, the fact that she's making, like, the place that we're at seem glorious just seems terrible. And why did I need her to tell me to put on pants? <laughs> Yay! Really? Alright, nothing else over here. Yeah, I'm assuming they do nothing. Okay. And this is like a dead end over there. So. Come on, go in. Yeah, this this just seems Let's hit the town and collect some coins. Mm. Seems like a bad idea. Gas storms, acid rains. Sunshine every day. Nice one, baby. Yeah, see, this isn't just this seems bad. <laughs> you are way too self extra peacoin. If you see a chimney, go ahead. Punch, punch, punch it. The provider likes to see a good punch. What the hell? That's a fish in front. Interesting. I have, I have a feeling she's like setting us up for something. I will say the setting for this is pretty awesome. Like I love the like dystopian cyberpunkish kind of world that we have going on here. Hmm. I don't even know if we need to collect all these coins. Um, I guess I'll do it anyways. Doesn't seem like there's anything else we can do. This is pretty much like... Almost like a walking sim, kind of. Alright, before we go down, I guess we'll just go over here and grab these. Come on. <laughs> this jingle. Okay. 
I just wanted to hear a little bit of that. Yeah, look at that. We got cameras watching our every move and stuff. Alright, we can't go over there because of an invisible wall. I'm assuming we can't go this way. Yeah, also an invisible wall. Yeah, see, like, following the coins and stuff, it feels like we're, like, falling breadcrumbs into, like, our doom. The fact that the thing's legs are like shaking. Yeah. Look on his face after that. Best Christmas ever. Yeah, see these goggles are, are not good. Can't use that. 100 pounder coin? Is that what it says? Huh. I just kind of want to take in the scenery a little bit. We'll go up real quick. Come on, move my little dude. There we go. So looks like there is more than a hundred coins that we can grab. There's a little X thing there. I'll check that out in just a moment. Just want to grab that real quick. Okay, so we can go this way. Is there any reason to go this way? There's one. Punch him. I don't want to punch him because I know what he is. So I'm not. I'm not gonna do it. I have to punch it? Okay. Uh, sorry, dude. I guess I gotta punch you. I wonder if this game has multiple endings or just the one. Music isn't really sexy. How come like four of them aren't moving? Alrighty. I also just like to watch. <laughs> what if I go over there? Nothing. Okay, now it's getting weirder. Yeah, it is. Nothing this way. 
Is that dude, dude? Is that dude jerking it? I think he is. Okay. What the hell did I just fall into? Okay, there I am. What the? So looks like we got a bunch of religious symbols. Interesting. I'm gonna guess that that thing that they mentioned earlier, um, like the vegan food or whatever, is actually just people. Soylent Green. Who are it? Are these people like hooked up? Yeah, they're hooked up to some machines by their face. Yeah. What the hell is this? Surprised their goggles aren't saying anything. Alright, what's gonna happen if we get here? Is this the end? There we go. Why would you hook yourself up? What? Oh, okay, we're like destroying it. How did he know to do that though? How would he know that that's what you have to do? Looks like our goggles are gone. Guess we go in here. Okay, he refuses to go into the dark. There's nothing over here we can do. Let's go back. Oops. Just see if there's anything here we miss. No. Okay. Let's check this out again. Let's see. Okay, maybe it's just a hole? Or does he just not want to step into... Oh, there we go. I'm so dumb. It's right here. <laughs> this, is, this reminds me of the uh, last scene from Raiders of the Lost Ark. Oh, we got a dinosaur. 
Are we going to find the Ark of the Covenant? Make it outside? Or is this all just an illusion? Because it looks like there's still buildings around. Okay, I guess I go this way. Oh, are we outside? Let's see. can't really tell. I mean, there's some out... I mean, it could just be lights. Because we, we can't see the like, the ceiling or anything. Of... Let's keep going. At least this looks a lot better than uh, where we were at. Well... Interesting. This feels like it's, uh, cause like you see, oh, I can't bring my, my mouse cursor, but you see like different species it looks like. It looks like this is like a DNA vault or something. I'm assuming that's what this is. You think if this is like a, an actual thing that they would have like higher guardrails? This doesn't seem very safe. But yeah, I think this is like a DNA vault. What the hell? Are they like trying to make people? And they failed? Can't interact with that. Penis. Huh. We just flushed a dude. <laughs> Why is it letting us in? Because I have a feeling we're not supposed to be here. Like story wise. Hmm. This is pretty. Reminds me of some place in uh, San Francisco. Obviously, it's not as elaborate and stuff like this. It has like similar features. And before we go up the stairs, I just want to see what's over here real quick. Nothing.
Who the hell is this? Naked old dude. Assuming they want us to get into the chair. Is he dead? Was that like a thing where we can choose if we wanted? Okay. I'm gonna try to like load back into that part and see if I can click on anything else to see if we get different endings. That was interesting. They had all these voice talents, really? It didn't seem like there's that much voice acting in this. So this is like a college project, it seems. It was interesting. I mean, it's pretty much like a walking sim, but they had nice visuals and stuff. I'm sure there's like a Reddit or something out there that like breaks down and goes really in depth about how like much of a story this game had and like all the, th can I not load back into, uh, why is it locked? It takes me all the way back to here. Well, I don't want to do all that again. <laughs> I don't know why it won't let me uh, go where I want, but um, there we go. There's Burning Daylight. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you guys have any games you guys recommend, whether they be free to play or, you know, uh, any other like indie games, uh, let me know. It doesn't have to be like this kind of style, but I'm always like... I'm always up to checking out games that, I mean, I'm sure people have heard of this game maybe because it's free to play. So I'm assuming people, you know, would always, would check them out. But uh, I'm always down to check out games that are very niche um, and don't get a lot of attention. If you guys have any games out there that, you know, probably aren't that well known and stuff, uh, let me know and I'll see if I can check them out. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.